To begin with, make sure you have your illustration imported into Procreate Dreams. Today I'm using one of my illustrations in my children's limerick book. The link is below if you'd like to take a look. So to begin with, let's go ahead and click on Add and Track. And we're going to put the fireflies here. Click on the Draw tool, click on the brush, and Calligraphy. And I like Monoline brush. And here I want the fireflies to be small, so I go to the smallest brush size here. And then click on the color. And I like bright yellow for these bugs. And click the brush to get out of this. And also click the brush again, and you're out of the brushes here. Let's zoom in. And here we're just going to draw a tiny little dash here, just so it kind of resembles a bug. Now let's add the glow to the firefly. So click on layers and click the plus sign here. And we're just going to pick our brush. I want airbrushing and soft brush. Let's go to the brush size and make sure it's around 3% or so. And then all you do is just draw a quick circle on the firefly and that gives it a nice glow. Okay, looks great. So now let's go to this sliver of a track and long press and fill duration. And here is the one simple trick. We can just take this one firefly and keep duplicating them. So long press, track options, duplicate. And now we have our second firefly. Now click on the playhead. Just make sure it's at the beginning, move, move and scale. Now click on the white keyframe, flip it up till it's the playhead, and just move your second firefly to another area on the illustration. And I'll place mine off screen over here. Now let's make a third firefly. Long press on this track, track options, duplicate. Now we notice the keyframe is here again. Let's flip it up till we get the playhead and drag this one, just another area on the illustration. Okay, now we have three fireflies to work with here. Let's go down to the first one and click on the playhead. Make sure you're at the beginning. Click move and move and scale. Now we wanna use the perform button. Click on the circle, modify, and I like to keep it up around 20 so it kinda of smooths out your hand gestures. Now grab the firefly and just move your firefly in any which direction you'd like. And I'm just gonna keep moving this on and around until the timeline stops. And there it is. Swipe to the left, oh, it looks very good. And click done. Okay, great job. So now let's go to the second firefly and just zoom in, click on the playhead, make sure you're at the beginning. And here it is. Click the perform button. And again, just move your firefly wherever you like to move it. You can see the first firefly flying as well. So it's a good reference. Swipe to the left. And now there are two fireflies flying around. That looks great. Now let's do the same thing on the third firefly here. Again, the playhead at the beginning, click on the playhead, click on move, and move in scale. Click the live perform button, and again, just move it around, flying along with his friends. It's basically the same for how many fireflies you wanna add. You can add two, three, a hundred, <laughs> any amount you'd like. Now I'm going to add a few more just for the finished product, but again, just repeat the steps that we just went through and it'll look great. And with the wonders of editing, we have all the fireflies that I wanted to add here, and hopefully you added some as well. So we wanna click stop in four fingers and press play. And there you have it. I hope this level up tutorial can help you increase your skills using Procreate Dreams. And if you like this video, please don't forget to like and subscribe. Also, please check out my links below like my children's limerick book and online shop. Click on these videos to continue leveling up with Procreate Dreams. Thanks again for watching and see you next time.